We'll be right back. Well, we're back with former UMB hockey player Matt Niskanen. <laughs> How are you doing? So you signed the big deal with the Dallas Stars. Did the Minnesota Wild call? Uh, they didn't at all. Uh, well, actually, I did talk to them before I got drafted a little bit. I had a, a meeting with them down at the XL, and uh, they were just kind of trying to get get to know me a little bit, put a name to a face and all that. But uh, I did talk to them a little bit, but they didn't draft me. Dallas did. So, so Matt, you came out of Mountain Iron, Minnesota, played your high school hockey on the Iron Range. Did you ever dream that you'd sign an NHL contract? I mean, obviously, you I'm sure you, you wanted to and dreamt of it, but did you ever think you, the day would really come? Yeah, uh, obviously, hockey's pretty big on the range, and uh, I've always wanted to be a pro player. And uh, I don't know, I never really dreamt about signing the contract, but I've always dreamt about playing in the NHL and still got a little bit of ways to go for that. But uh, getting a little bit closer now and uh, just uh, enjoying the times right now. It's uh, exciting. Well, that's a good attitude to have. You're just a sophomore last year. Um, so you had two years left. Um, you've got two years to develop with this uh, hockey club. You're going to play, uh, are you going to play at Iowa? More than likely. I'm, I'll go to Dallas's camp this September and uh, see what happens. But more than likely, I'll be in Iowa and uh, just try to get better and better as, as we go. And uh, who knows, maybe I might sneak in for some games this year. Uh, Nico Sacchetti also signed with Dallas uh, Stars. Uh, yeah. What was that conversation like uh, when you guys talked for the first time? <laughs> he was so fired up. And I just, I absolutely couldn't believe it when he got drafted by them. I mean, because I heard a lot of teams really liked him. And I just never dreamt that he'd get drafted by the same team. But we were both so fired up and uh, cracking a few jokes here and there about different stuff. And uh, he was excited. I was happy for his family and for him. Good kid. He deserves it. You guys played together at Virginia? Yeah. When I was a senior in high school, he was a, a freshman on our team. And he was really good back then, even uh, as a freshman. And uh, had some special memories that year. I went to a state tournament. And uh, he, was, he was a good kid and uh, a lot of good memories there. Former UMD Bulldog hockey player uh, Junior Lassard uh, signed with the Dallas Stars. You didn't play with Junior. Did I didn't play college jun with Junior, but uh, this spring actually I played with him in Iowa. I actually uh, he was on that team. He's been there for I think two years now, and uh, I actually got to live with him this this past spring when I went down and uh, played for about seven weeks there, and I got to live with Junior and. Uh, he was one of their leading scorers and their uh, alternate captain, and what a great guy he is. That was such a good experience to be with him. How much has he helped you so far? Oh, well, just, just kind of, he's get, given me uh, kind of weathered just to know what it's like to, and what it takes to be a pro hockey player, and uh, he works his butt off, and uh, he's a really good pro as far as the way he prepares himself each and every day, and uh, he's helped me a lot that way, just uh, getting used to the pro hockey lifestyle. You know, it's it's got to be something for for a young kid like yourself. When you step on that ice, and granted, you're going to be in some exhibition games and what have you, and some practices. But when you step on that ice, you're going to see Mike McDonald. You're going to see some other names, some veterans, uh, future Hall of Famers. Uh, that's got to be a little daunting, I would think. Oh, yeah, I'd say it's uh, going to be quite an experience. I'm not sure really what to expect or what's going to happen, but. Uh just go in there with a clear mind, I guess, and uh, do the best I can, take it day by day, and uh, just enjoy it. I mean, what an experience it's going to be. I'm, I can't imagine what's going to be a step on the ice with Madonna if that chance happens. So just uh, take it day by day, I guess. Talk about your two seasons at UMD. Of course, uh, Coach Scott Sandlin, did he recruit you? Yes, he did. Yep, I was a junior year in high school. Uh, talked to Coach Sandlin and uh, Lee Davidson and Steve Rock all quite a bit. and. Uh, Sure happy that I came here and uh, absolutely love my two years here. Well, we're going to miss number 15 on the blue line. Sad to see you go, but at the same time, we're happy. We're proud of you that you signed your pro contract and your uh, career from here is going to take off. And who knows, maybe things won't work out in Dallas and you'll get a contract signed with the Wild. Yeah, huh? that, you never know. It could happen. <laughs> Nowadays, uh, that, that would be fine with me, I guess. But uh, no, I like Dallas, and uh, but just uh, happy with uh, my last two years here at UMD. Absolutely love the city, loved uh, the campus and uh, playing for the dogs and just uh, moving forward to play pro hockey now and I can't wait to get started here. Let's talk about the days of high school. Did you go to state tournament uh, when you played high school? Yeah, my senior year, was first time uh, ever in Blue Devils history that we made it to the state tournament. And uh, How things go? At the state tournament, we didn't fare so well. I think we, we got spanked both games and we went two and out. But uh, okay. what an experience down here at the deck uh, for the section finals that year. It was against? Close, uh, against Tibbing. We beat them 5 3, my senior Cross year. Cross town rivals. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Wow. It was, it was wild and kind of ironic. They knocked us out the two years before that. So there's some <laughs> good history there. And uh, there's some bad blood, to say the least. Um, 
Uh, what a what a memorable night, though. I just yeah. that was my yeah. favorite memory by far. That was awesome. Well, getting down to state, and you know, uh, granted things didn't go your way, but that's got to be a thrill. Uh, what do you recall from uh, the two games you played down there? Who were the teams you played? Well, we played uh, St. Thomas Academy, first game, and uh, then in the consolation bracket over at Mariucci, we played uh, Albert Lee. Okay. And uh, two pretty good teams. Uh, St. Thomas just won it, I think, a year or two ago, and. Uh, what an experience though, step out on that XL ice and uh, just with the TV coverage and the, just how history, how much of a story tournament that is and you know, it's, that's what you play for your whole life is just to get a chance to go to that state tournament and I just loved every second of it besides the losing part. Number 15, former UMD hockey player uh, Matt Niskanen uh, now signed a pro contract. He's going to play with the Dallas Stars. Uh, we'll put up with that for now, but <laughs> and uh, we're going to follow your career, and maybe we can do this again in the future. Maybe see you out here next summer and uh, go out and uh, score your first goal. And what the heck, do it against the Wild. That'd be kind of neat. Oh, that'd be something. <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. Matt, thanks. Thanks a lot. Yeah, thanks, Ryan. Good luck. Yeah, thank you.